everybody. Welcome to another episode of Cold. Today we are going to be experiencing the Core Clementine Coats de Provence 2019 Rosé. I just saw this at Whole Foods. I was like, oh, I'll do it. I'll do it. Let's do it. Okay. What even makes a rosé? I don't even know. Actually, I should do more research. I'm going in completely blind on this. I'm, I don't even know how rosé is made. I don't know what goes into the process. I can't fucking open this. There we go. Let's give this a pour. Oh, I have a little water in here. Okay, it's nice and good pour in the sunlight. Look at that. If rose gold was a color, this is it. Like if, like my straw, it's a bronze, no, it's a rose gold straw, but if, oh fuck. I should bring this up. <laughs> oh gosh, growing pains. But um, here, let's move this back down actually. Okay, but if I, was to liquefy my straw, it would blend in with this so, so well. Okay, color, I really like the color. I think that's what drew me to the bottle was the color. I smell it. it. Smells like alcohol. Wow, surprise. This is gonna be so different once I start tasting wine. It'll be so different than um, kombucha. Okay. Let's give this a good old sippy sip. Here's the thing. I'm just not too much of an alcohol person. It's just really strong for me. It's like drinking mouthwash. If I was to drink this personally, I put maybe this much alcohol, how much I have, and then I put maybe some lemonade or some blood orange soda. But yeah, I already feel the alcohol in my system. It's like, just relax. Look at me, just relax. Let's get a, let's get a thumbnail. <laughs> what am I doing? something I don't know what I'm gonna do yet that was my uh, first wine on cold I'll forever remember this twenty nineteen was an interesting year for me what am I observing every time I'm just not an alcohol person. Uh, uh, uh. I went to Flying M last night. The coffee ho coffee shop. I went to Flying M. I had a I had a mimosa and that was actually really good. That was good. Like I enjoyed it. The orange juice to champagne level was just really balanced. But this is just straight up wine. I think maybe I should put some other things in there. So. Um, that's how I'm gonna drink it. Yeah, that's it. This is just a special little short episode of cold. I'm already thinking, what should I do next? Like, what should I do afterwards? Get a little more um, intimate when we're talking about this stuff. What should we do? What should we do? What are we gonna do next? 
I'm cold. The show. You know what I think I should do is jump into food as well. I'm going to reach out to this restaurant called Kin in Boise, downtown. There's also this cooking school. It's called Season and Taste. That'd be really good. I think that'd be really good for me. Let me see what I can do. I'm a person who will get shit done. If I want something, I will go get it. I get whatever the fuck I want. Because I put in the fucking work. I bust my ass to get what I want. You best believe that if I want something... I'll put in the absolute most empathy and kindness. And I'll be patient as fuck. But I'll work hard every day. I'll work hard every goddamn day. But I'll be patient for years. And I'll get it. If I really want it. I'll hold on to ideas for years. There's shit I haven't even started yet. But I've had in the back of my head since I was like 17, 16. 18 as a fucking teenager I knew I was going to change the goddamn world I'm about to do that shit I'm going to do some cool fucking shit I'm going to spread some goddamn positivity around it's going to be fucking awesome <laughs> here we go welcome to cold everybody here's the thumbnail look at with the with my reflector Okay, there we go. I love it. Okay, love you guys.